algebra factorization. Now we do these examples. 1. We have a term 5x and 10y. 5x we can write as 5 times x. 10y we write as 5 times 2y. Now 5 is a common factor. So we write the common factor here. Then insert a bracket. This 5 is gone. This is gone. So we left here with x. Then plus 2y. If you open this bracket, we will get this expression back. 4x squared can be written as 2x times 2x minus 2x can be written as 2x times 1. 2x is a common factor. So this is gone. So we left 2x minus 1 inside the bracket. AB squared says so AB times B. Here we have A squared B, which can be written as A times AB. So AB is a common factor. Start bracket, so this AB is gone. So we're left with B plus A inside the bracket. 6a can be written as 3a times 2a minus 9a is 3a times 2, so times 3. 3a is a common factor. Start bracket, so this 3a is gone. So we're left with 2a minus 3. Four A B squared we write as four A B B then we have eight A B can be written as four A B times two then twelve A squared B can be written as four A A B times 3. Now we look for a highest common factor. So we got 4 AB, 4 AB, 4 AB. So we write outside 4 AB, start bracket, so we got B, then we have minus 2 from here left with a and 3, so which is 3a. So we have 6 can be written as 2 times 3, then we have a, b, c, here we have 2, a, c, times 1. So we have a 2 common. Then we have AC, AC. So we left here with 3B. From here we left with just 1. Now try this exercise yourself when you've done it, then check the answers. Here's question 1, here's question 2. Question 1, 2 is a common factor. Five is a common factor. 
7 is a common factor. 4 is a common factor. 2a is a common factor. 5x is a common factor. 7x is a common factor. 7 is a common factor. Here we have 7 is a common factor. Five is a common factor. Then we will have a plus two b. Six x would be common factor. Then we will have y minus two. Here, 3xy is a common factor, and inside be 2x, then y. Here, we will have 2 is a common factor, then 5x minus 8. Finally, a, B is a common factor, C, B, C, then 1.